welcome back everyone and this is your epic arms workout challenge today let's begin this session with a quick and effective warm-up first and i will give you a heads up what to expect from this workout challenge so step wider with me and your first warm-up exercise today is your simple air squats arms up front for a little bit more intensity so we can wake up this body much quicker and get ready to burn a lot of calories so today your epic arms workout challenge team we have two blocks your first block is your add-on exercises and your second block is your unilateral exercises which simply means we will complete all four exercises of that block on one side and then we will repeat the same exercises on the other side this is your upper body challenge but as always guys we target the full body and today we simply put extra focus on our arms and shoulders give me a few more squats and we're gonna move to the second warm-up exercise which is your burpee to your jug guys come on up excellent work if you're not doing your burpee hops simply step back for my beginners come on back give me a good jug so we can wake up this body quick half safe and effective workout and of course burn a lot of calories get ready guys to put those arms and shoulders on fire today of course i have a couple surprises for you today which i'm not gonna say right now but you will see all right i'm using two different weights of the dumbbells today i have a one 12 pound dumbbell for the first block for the last exercise and i'm using for main weights my eight pound dumbbells today each dumbbell is eight pound you can use lighter or a little bit heavier weights if you want to just make sure that your shoulders can support all the reps give me one more excellent your third and final warm-up exercise today i can feel how my heart rate is rising coming down with me is your plank to extended plank walk let's begin my beginners if you have to put your knees on the floor definitely do that but always try to start strong guys because you will have a chance to downgrade anytime you want let's pick up the pace on this extended plank a little bit faster guys all right almost there almost finished with the warm-up give me four more walk forward breeze guys two more and let's do one more all right fantastic work come on up guys drink your water and let's set the mind for absolute success as I said, your first block is your add-on exercises. We have four exercises total in this block. We will begin with first two, and every single time we will add one more exercise. So we will have a three rounds total to complete this block. I will begin with my eight pound dumbbells. And your first exercise for 16 reps is a front raise to standing row get ready guys set here we go eight pounds for each arm it's a pretty decent weight for 16 reps considering we have our isometric pulls on top guys doing this row all the way stay tall abs in guys and tight my friends do not drop those elbows push it through I know if you would have to move eventually to the one arm raise and row to alternate the arms you definitely can do that we have seven repetitions left let's push it through this is very challenging wait for me just for the arms do not swing guys release with control fully that's it we have three reps to finish come on guys 
push it through. Last one, that is very, very challenging. Thank you for not giving up. Beautiful work, guys. And your second exercise here is gonna be your bend over row to the squat front arm raise. We will be standing in the bend over position all the time. So that way, take a look at a quick demo at the screen. So that way, you will work your back as well. Definitely your legs and arms. Step hips width apart or slightly wider, right? Get ready for your bend over position. That's where you're gonna come back from your squat. Shoulders up, back and down. One row, one squat arm raise. Let's begin. That's it, you come back to your bend over position. When you do, guys, your squats, make sure your knees away from your toes. We got this. Not as challenging just the row, but bringing arms front in that squat simultaneously is definitely a challenge. That's it. We have only eight repetitions to complete. Come back, guys, to your bend over position. When you come up, do not swing your weights up. Lift, guys. And definitely do not drop them, release. Again, I will repeat myself. Pick up the weight, guys. Your shoulders can support and you can confirm a good quality form for yourself. Last one. This is it. Good work. Bring those dumbbells down for just a second. And we will begin from the exercise number one, one more time, because this is your add-on exercises block. And then at the end, we will add the third exercise. All right. This is an arm and shoulder killer. Let's go ahead and get ready for the front raise and the 90 degree hold press. All right, you ready? Shoulders up, back and down. We're not going to quit. We might modify a little bit if we have to. That's it. Push it through, guys. I count, I promise you. I'm not gonna make you to work one less, maybe just one more. I know that's what you would like to hear. Push it. All right, we are halfway through with this one. This is really challenging from now. Don't quit. Stay guys solid on those feet, that's very important. And do not back, bend backwards. Solid like a mountain. Push it through, we have four reps left. Those eight pounds, really a killer. Two reps left, everyone. Let's push it together. All right, one more. Push press, back, excellent four, guys. Your second exercise. Your bend over position, row, then front squat with a front raise arms. Shoulders up, back and down. Always come back to bend over position. Up, in and tight, my friends. Here we go. That's it. Knees, guys, away from your toes on your squat. Arms getting tired, definitely. This is a great combination in this workout for your upper body and your lower body strings with a stronger focus, definitely, on arms and shoulders, especially with my upcoming surprises. Push it through. We have, guys, eight repetitions to complete. On your rows, pull, push, guys. Do not drop those arms. With control release, that's it. We're almost through. 
four reps to complete. That's it. Come back to that bundle of position, guys. Control your back, my friends. We got this. Last one for this one. That's it. That's it. Good completion with the row. All right, put your dumbbells back, drink your water, and we're adding third exercise in the mix. Your next exercise is your standing dumbbell angel to wide grip over hot press. Solid as a mountain, arms getting tired, you are not going to quit. All right, team, let's begin. In case if you have severe neck or back injuries, replace your angels with just lateral raise or bicep curl, guys. We're working. Push it through. Eight pounds is a challenging weight for this type of the exercises, especially for 16 reps through. We don't have to hurry up, guys. I want to see the full control of your body. Scoop the stomach in, stay tall and strong. In case you would have to alternate your one arm at the time, at the second half of this exercise, you definitely can. All right, we are halfway through. This is a true challenge for arms. Come on up. We will finish. We're not going to quit. Again, if you have to do one at a time, you can, guys. In order to give your arms a little break, maybe just for a couple reps, and then you come back for your double arm. That's it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We're not going to quit. We can't quit right now. We have only four reps left. Push it through. That's it. Muscle up, guys. I know arms is getting tired after these two exercises. Prior this one, two more reps. We got this. Solid on your legs, guys. All right, muscle up, everyone. That's it. Push press, release with control. Excellent. Three in a row exercises complete. We have to add one more exercise in the mix. Final one for this block, for this add-on exercises block. But after, we we'll take from the top these three exercises first. All right. Arms really tired right now. We're probably gonna go a little bit slower. Modify with a single arm if you have to. Don't quit. All right. Front raise to the standing press. Let's go. That's it. It's gonna fly by really quickly, my friends. The second block is so fun as well. Our unilateral exercises today for one side only. I wasn't sleeping last night and creating your workouts, guys. All right, let's kick it. All right, team, we are halfway through. This is the time for you to push. That's it. Perfect. Muscle up, guys. Do not back bend. I specifically turn in the sideways for you right now. So you see clearly, I'm not doing this movement to lift my dumbbells. This is very important. Three repetitions left. Solid on your feet. Come on. Last one. Push it. We've got this. This is very hard for the third round straight for those arms. All right, guys, bend over nice and quickly. Don't take a big break. We have three more exercises to complete. Bend over row to squat with a front raise. Get ready, guys, good quality rows. Come back to the bend over position. That's it. Form, guys. 
Again, we don't have to hurry up. Take every single movement. Serious, guys. Every single rep, like a final. That's it. Push it through. Every single rep, guys. You feel what you're doing because that's where your results. You have to be aware of your form, of your form, every single rep. We got this. We have only eight left. Getting harder. I almost don't feel my legs. I feel them, but it's so irrelevant to how my arm's feeling right now. Come on. That's it. We got these guys, only four repetitions to complete. That's perfect. Give me full quality row. Don't cut the corners, guys. Push it through. That's it, let's finish with the row. Nice and clean. That's it, put your dumbbells back. All right, congrats. We have only two more exercises to push through. Your next one, your angel, which we already did. Again, replace it with bicep curl on the side or lateral raise up to 90 degrees if you do have severe neck and back injuries. We got this, let's go. That's it guys, together. I promise you we're gonna do just 16, no more. All right guys, help me to count. Number three. Four is a significant one, it's getting harder from here. That's it, we got this. So exciting to complete this block. Many times I don't want exercise to finish, but right now my arms screaming, please let's get over with this. Push it. All right, guys, this one is gonna put us halfway through. I know you can. That's it. All right, guys, this is a hard time to push. Let's go. Push it through. Last six are gonna be really challenging. Muscle up, use the arms and shoulders. Stay solid on those feet. Try not to help yourself, guys, with the lower body. We got this. Push it up. I feel like my face is lifting as well. That's how hard those angels, let's go. That's it, two reps to push, guys. It makes me feel really much better thinking we are not doing this angel anymore today. That's it, that's perfect. We got this. All right, you're gonna put your eight pounds set or whatever lighter weights you have for the next exercise. You can use just two dumbbells you've been working with or if you have one heavier dumbbell, I have a little pounds here for the wood chopper. Take a look on your demo. Wood chopper tricep. We will alternate the sides. This is our final exercise and we're doing it only one time. You're gonna give it a little pivot as well. It's slightly more comfortable to do it with the one heavier dumbbell, especially because of the tricep. Here we go. Good pivot, good tricep. So that's 16 tricep, kickbacks in the standing position, and eight on each side, wood choppers. That's it. Perfect form, everybody. Push it through. That's it. That's it, all the way, guys. Chop it with a good pivot so you can use and work your back, not just your arms. Little pivot on the feet. We are, guys, halfway through. We have only six reps to complete. 
lift guys fully tricep extend fully all the way behind four repetitions that's it when you do your wood chopper don't drop those arms guys release it looks like you slam it a little bit but you slam with control as well last one beautiful that was a challenging wood chopper with a tricep we did it really really good all right guys your first surprise today we have 32 body weight reps downward facing dog to your plank single arm if you can do the single arm do all 32 with the double arms regular dog to plank otherwise we do 16 on one arm and 16 on another arm that's going to be particularly hard after what we just complete make sure your arms are not sweaty guys begin we have 16 reps on each side i count my friends my beginners if you have to put your knees on the floor you want to do still one arm but you want to put your knees on the floor you can do that or you can opt out of single arm and do all 32 guys with the both hands we get in there we have six repetitions left again make sure that your arms your hands are not sweaty on your mat safety is your number one priority probably even more important than your form all right guys last one okay let's switch we got this let's do it i count guys you want to put your knees on the floor you can come back to the full plank as full as possible i can see myself i work by sensation i do my best to release all the way down to the plank guys all right we are halfway through come on champions we do it together six reps to finish don't hurry up guys pull it down pull it up three two last one we did it together come on up guys all right your first surprise is complete i'm so proud of you guys i know no one quit over there we're doing together we started together we finished together as a team all right guys your unilateral look we're going to repeat each side twice so for each side for right and left we're gonna have a two rounds total even though it is a unilateral exercises i want you to hold your other dumbbell in your other hand just for the extra weight for the legs your first exercise is your Froger squat arm overhead negative overhead press negative because we're moving together with the squat guys all right my friends we have a 10 reps for each exercise four exercises total begin one this is your Froger squat guys i want to see you squatting nice and low that's it five we have halfway through that's it push it up all the way give me two more just in case guys that's it and last one beautiful all right your second exercise guys is your high pull to the cross body bicep curl hold this hand just right here so this arm is steady and not super relaxed so hold the dumbbell we're working the same arm which we did overhead press let's go cross body that's it perfect reach guys all the way my friends good job we are halfway through give me the good quality high pull Abs in and tight, and the quality 
full cross body hammer curl. That's it. That's it. And give me one more just in case, just in case. That's it, if you started a little bit later. Your next exercise is very challenging. This is your lateral push press. We stop 90 degrees, take a look on the screen, and we do the 90 degree angle bicep curl on top. Pop the bicep. All right, guys, get ready. We come back to this position. Here we go. That's it. We come back to the waistline. Perfect. Push it. That's it. Come on, Tim. Almost halfway through with this one. We have only five reps left. Stay solid, guys, on your feet, especially pay attention to this on the final four, which we have left. That's it, don't quit, don't quit, my friends. Two reps to complete. Last one, muscle up. All right, champions. Good job, my superstars, right? We have one more exercise for this arm. This is gonna be your crunch with the palm looking towards your body, knee lift. So you work in your arm, you definitely work in your abs. Stay solid, begin. One, knee to the elbow, all the way release. Activate the mid section of your body in order to do a quality crunch. So this is, of course, your arm work, we halfway through, but you also want to keep the midsection really active, guys. Three reps to go. That's good. Final one. Perfect, guys. Let's drink our water quickly. Move your arms, give a couple shoulder rolls to your arms if you have to. We will repeat the same four exercises on other side. Hold your dumbbell for extra weight for the legs on your progger. On other three exercises is optional, but I strongly recommend you to have the dumbbell in your hand so you don't relax uncontrollably your other arm. All right, guys, progger squat, negative overhead press, begin. We have only 10 reps for each exercise. Feels so easy right now. These are nice and fresh, rested. We have five reps to complete. Give me a quality progress squat. Don't back bend, guys. Push it up. It's a challenging version of the squat. The weights are not as heavy, but still, when we simultaneously push the dumbbell and come on back up, excellent. Come on up, guys. Your high pull to crossover hammer curl. All right, ready? Begin. All the way bicep across towards that shoulder. That's it. Perfect. Good quality high pull, guys. Nice and high. Crossover. That's it. Push it through. Five left. This it. We have three reps to complete, guys. Good quality crossover. Perfect, last one. All right. I think this is the most challenging exercise of this block. This is gonna be your lateral push extension, lateral press, single arm to the bicep curl. Begin, guys. This is it. Watch for a couple times. Make sure you extend that up to 90 degrees. If you can, do your best to do that. Do not drop your elbow. We are halfway through. Don't back bend, guys. Last five gonna be challenging. Last four even more challenging. You're not going to quit. 
That's it. Push it. One more, Tim. We got this. Let's do one more just in case. Just in case I miscount. All right. One more is better than one less. All right, guys. Knee to elbow, front crunch. Make sure you do your best. Activate your midsection, work the arm. We lift that knee and we release that elbow using our abs and load. That's it. We are five reps away from finishing our first round on both sides. That's it. Two more guys. All we have left is to repeat these four unilateral exercises on the other side. One on the right and one on the left. All right, guys. Begin with the side you did the first one. Progress squat to negative overhead press. Start with the arm extended over your head. Get ready. Set. We have only 10 repetitions. Begin. I want to see the quality of Frogger, guys. I know body gets a little bit tired, but we are not going to give up. We're very close to finish this epic arm workout challenge for today. Push it through. That's it, we have four reps. Four guys. Three, two, last one. Beautiful work, I know, body gets tired. Mind is going to push us through. All right, guys, high pull to cross body. Let's go. Nice and quick with a good form. Only 10 reps, guys. That's it. We have five reps to complete. And then my favorite exercise of this block coming. I like to convince myself that this is my favorite and I love it when it's so challenging. It's literally become easier. Try it. All right, let's do one more. That's it. We're going, guys. Lateral push press to 90 degree bicep. Begin. I can feel like my arms getting stronger and stronger. Hopefully you feel it as well. We've been doing a lot of arms exercises lately. Push it, team. This one is gonna put us to the halfway through. Control how high you lift that arm, guys. Last four gonna be epic challenging. That's it. Three left. Do not extend that elbow, guys. When you return back, I want you to hold that resistance. It's done for a reason here. That's it. One more. Let's do one just in case. I want to make sure that we did as many as we have to. All right. We're gonna go for the knee drive, your crunch, your arm working like crazy here too. Activate the midsection, guys, to release. One, two, three. Work it. Extend that arm all the way back, guys. Remember, your power is within, guys. Whether you think your body can do it or can't, you're gonna be always right. Your commitment, your power, your energy comes from inner self, guys, within. Tell yourself you can and you will. All right, great work, everyone. We're gonna go straight to the other side. If you need to take a water break, please do. Otherwise, we're ready to crush this side one more time. Begin. Nice, good quality Frogger team. You come up from Frogger, don't forget those glutes, squeeze them. Work in full body with a strong focus on arms and shoulders today. So do your best work possible. 
I can do it for you. I can guide you through this workout, cheer you up, motivate you, give you a great effective exercises, but you have to do your best. Remember that, like everything in life. Come on, push it. Your success depends just from you, not from external circumstances. All right, guys, high pull to cross body, begin. Be aware when you do your high pull, keep your wrist, guys, relaxed. Pull up with your elbow, shoulders staying in place. That's it. Lift and curl. Five left. That's it. We've got this. Three to go. All right, I'm gonna start to convince myself that I'm ready for my favorite exercise of this block. All right, guys, do not dare to extend that elbow. Return right up here. Let's go. That's it up. Perfect. Push it. We are halfway through. Only five reps left. Don't let me to miss count, guys. Four to go. Three left. Push it. Eight pounds killing my bicep and tricep here. We have one more. That is it. Take it back. All right, final exercise of this block. And we're gonna move to my final surprise, guys, of the day for you. Arm over hat. Get ready. Set knee to the elbow. Good job. Perfect. That is it. We have only five reps to complete, my friends. Five. Four. From the midsection. Three. Two, everybody. And the last one. Congratulations. You can put your dumbbells back, guys. Let's drink our water quickly. And we have quick push-up challenge to finalize this workout. We're gonna do three types of the push-ups. 10 repetitions, 10 reps for each. Your first one is a Spider-Man. Second one, your star, wide feet, wide legs. And the third one is your regular tricep. Your Spider-Man push-up, take a look quickly on the screen demo, guys. If you cannot do it with your knee, not a big deal. Just stop your foot outside. Only 10 reps, I know arms are tired. We can do it. Simultaneous, push down, knee to your elbow or to your shoulder. Begin. Come on, team. I know. We're halfway through. Put your knees on the floor, that one knee which left if you have to, two reps to complete. One more. That was very, very hard, especially after what we did with those arms. Your star, guys, your feet and your hands are really, really wide. Make sure that your hands are not slippery, guys. Get ready. Set knees on the floor, my beginners, if you have to. One. Two, push it through, guys. Ups in. We got this. Four reps left, guys. Push it through. Last one. Perfect. All right, your final one, the one you really love, the one you really, really, really perfected through all our hit workouts and our low impact exercises. If you want to do it on your knees, you can. I will begin on my feet and we'll see how it works for me after all we did. Let's go, guys. This is your final 10. We have five reps, guys. 
two complete. Don't quit. Five, four, three. My arms are shaking too. Last one, everyone. We did it together. Congratulations, guys. The main part is complete. We have a few super effective Pilates stretches today. So come on down, guys, with me on your knees in hands position. Go ahead and take your one leg to extension and your arm all the way. Opposite side, guys. Hold with me, guys. Four, four. Four, three. Four, two. And take this hand back on the floor. We're gonna go move that foot all the way outside and give it a good lateral stretch. Reach, guys. Inhalation, exhalation, draw your leg towards your foot. Reach and extend, guys. Four, three, two, and back to the side stretch extension all the way. Beautiful. We're going to come back up. And all we do, we take this arm, which was on top. We will thread the needle to give that shoulder a good quality stretch. Four, three, two. Come on back, we deserve it. All right, guys. Back to kneeling position. Opposite arm and leg. Scoop the belly in, reach it all the way through. Hold with me. And we're not just holding, right? We're extending and reaching all the way. Fingertip to the toes. Let's go ahead and take this hand on the floor. Move your foot slightly outward to find the balance. And we're reaching up and over. Four, guys. Three. Long and extended, arching that body. Prepare to lift that leg and draw it to your hand. Find the balance. Reach and extend, guys. Hold for four if you can with me. Three, two, we back to the lateral side extension on the kneeling position. That's it. And come on back, guys, to the center. We're going to thread the needle. Reach all the way up. First, all the way up, up, up. And take it down. Very good. Hold, guys, for four. Four, three, two, and all the way, guys. Nice and slow. Come on back to the center. We're gonna give a couple stretches to our arms up here as well. Just nice, long extension. Keep your hips above your knees. And to the other side. Feels so good. Come on up, guys, with me. Tuck your toes. With your dumber facing dog. We did so many cool exercises today to tone our arms, burn calories, and build a lean, beautiful body. I want you guys to be proud of yourself. Reach, hold, and all the way to the other side. Reach, hold. Come on up with me. Back up. All right, let's step a little bit wider reach up all the way my friends inhalation exhalation nice and full reach up let all the tension go you did amazing outstanding fantastic work guys as always i'm so proud of you team if you're new to my channel welcome on board that's what we do here every single day we push we get stronger we're working hard to achieve our goals and we are responsible people so make sure guys you leave me a comment down below i love to read them rest well recover well and i will see you all tomorrow